So the uh, 60th edition of the damn Grammys mm-hmm. happened uh, this past Sunday. And uh, Kendrick Lamar swept that shit. He yeah. swept that shit. The hip, all the hip hop shit. Anyways, uh, I know you uh, probably didn't. I did not tune in. <laughs> the funny thing was, I wasn't going to tune in either. Yeah, because I already have like this disdain for for the Grammys. I, I got I got disdain for all award shows pretty much nowadays. Like as I got older, right? It, it, for all award shows, pretty much all award, even the BET Hip Hop Awards. Yeah. We we got we got to show love to the hip hop awards. Yeah, I, I'm gonna have to. They start, do the yeah. hip hop shit right. They do for the most part, and I, I I catch some of it a lot of the time, but I don't watch it the whole way through anymore like I used to. Right, right. I mean, I'll catch things here and there, and then I'll actually see some replays or repeat. You know, some people put on on Facebook or YouTube or whatever, and I'll see shit through there like that, like the the performances and you know or highlights, but. You just rarely just I into it. yeah rarely I watch it from beginning to end. I may catch a little bit from flipping through the TV. I'll see something that's on, but then once something that isn't appealing is on or something, I usually switch, switch it, it and then I don't even remember it's on. Or some well, shit. the Grammys was interesting yeah. because it was a lot. It was uh, hip hop was there. It, yeah, apparently. You know yeah, yeah. Um, I hear this after the fact. <laughs> real talk though. Side note: They were doing the best <laughs> country album. Uh huh. And I'm listening, you know how you do like the little nominees and they're like, and here your nominees and they kind of play some of the song or whatever. And I was like, this shit's whack. This shit's pop. This shit is kind of, kind of trash. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, this real nigga country music came on. Like I heard it instantly and I was like, that's the one. Okay. And he won that bitch and too. He won it. it was Chris Stapleton. I don't even yeah. know who he is. But I, I know that he makes trill ass country music. Yeah. I heard it. I just knew it. I was like, oh, this is it. That's the winner. And he won. <laughs> somebody told me he's the Kendrick Lamar of country music right oh, now. Oh, shit. Somebody, somebody told me. Oh, shit. I don't know nothing about it. But y'all should go check it out. Chris Stapleton. I'm, I'm going to go check it. I added I'm him little, I added into my title. After saying that, yeah, I'm a little interested. I'm, I, I'm I added him to my title, and I was like, yo, I'm going to listen to Chris Stapleton. Cause What's this, crazy is my girl probably knows all about him. Right. It sounded like some Johnny Cash level type. You know what oh, I'm saying? Shit. It sounded like that real deal shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But uh, back, back to back to, back to the hip hop. Yeah. <clears throat> Kendrick Lamar won everything, won best rap album. Do you think he deserved best rap album over Jay-Z? Yeah, that's, that is a tough one. That is a tough one. Uh, I have to lean and say, yeah. I'm going to have to lean and just, just lean over a little bit and be like, yeah. Just, I think it was a little more impactful. It just was. I mean, Jay, not to say Jay Z's wasn't. I mean, Jay Z's was, it was a great album also. Right. I mean, and his videos and everything, the way it came out, the way he laid it out, it was dope. Definitely dope. Uh, but Kendrick. That damn, damn, that damn album. <laughs> that damn album, I tell you. <laughs> right. Nah, that shit was fucking fire. I mean. It was. There's a lot of energy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's kind of the, uh, the youthful energy that, you know what I'm saying? And I think that's what, it played a lot of, into that, definitely, right. because, I mean, Jay Z was more laid back, old school, old head, dropping knowledge, you know, and just, Spitting real shit, deep shit, but I'm just kind of, I'm man. just kind of surprised that I, the story of OJ didn't get any. You know what I'm saying? That, that song was that is wild that it didn't get no kind of award. Right? That's that's that was a very impactful song. But you know yeah. what though? Jay Z boycotted the Grammys for years so Kendrick Lamar could win tonight. I'm gonna go ahead and say that. Hot take, hot take, hot take. That is a good point. Right? I mean, yeah. I mean, the Grammys they've had a lot of of, of rough years. They yeah. definitely have. Even now, do people con- consider this a rough Still, year? Yeah, you know what I'm saying Still. for the Grammys. I I think Kendrick probably deserved deserved best rap album. I do. Uh, Jay Z. I don't feel like he was snubbed. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. I do feel like he should have won something. something. I think you know he, yeah, maybe nominated for something else. Or just <clears throat> just won something. Yeah. Right. I mean, SZA didn't win either, and SZA's album is like all like that's crazy. They play. She had a. Big ass year. Yeah, it was crazy. You know what I'm saying? She, she didn't, didn't win, win anything. Yeah, yeah. She that's why a lot of people are saying that there's still some kind of backlash in there. Right. You know, a lot of race card shit they still pull. Mm. And I don't know. It, you, 
you can say it, but then you can say, look what Ken- Kendrick did. Right. So. And Kendrick kept it black as fuck. Fuck yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I, you do gotta, I do gotta commend Jay Z though, because even though Kendrick kept it black as fuck, uh, Jay Z included like the whole fucking culture into his, the rollout of his album. Yeah, he did. Everybody's in on this shit. That fucking video that he did with, uh, Michael B. Jordan and the dude from Everybody. Moonlight. Yeah. That was directed by Ava DuVernay. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, he had everyone. Everybody was in on this shit. Yeah. <laughs> it was big. I mean, I I can't say it was it was big. The uh, the video that he did um with um your boy from uh Hellboy. I can't think of his name. Ron Ron, Ron Perlman. Perlman. Yeah. That video that had the black guy with the t- talking. That was a I was video. actually surprised that Jay-Z had him in the video yeah. because I watch I got Crackle and I watch Startup on Crackle. I'd never seen this guy before Startup. Yeah. And so for him to have him in there, I'm like, holy shit, Jay-Z really knows like who the fuck is popping out yeah. here. You know what I'm saying? He's making noise, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So we got to... It's just... Yeah. Even if you didn't like the music, just the fact that he was able to... Di- like, the the video where he did, it was like a Friends remake. And it had Issa Rae, and it had uh, uh the new black comedian. I can't think of his name right now. But it had everybody. It had Lil Rail. It had everybody in yeah. this shit. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Everybody. So, I mean... <laughs> the way he laid all that... I mean, that was some artistic ignorant shit. The On a whole he, other level. Yes. Yeah, the way he laid it out. Right. Definitely was. I mean, he deserves something. Something, man. Definitely did. Yeah. And so, he, he was snubbed in a sense. Right. Not necessarily when he was going against Kendrick. Or top hip-hop. I mean, Kendrick Kendrick has the edge of the youth, you know, right. and just that energy. You the know? now. Yeah, the now. Right. Where Jay-Z, you know, there's people who are like, ah, he's... A lot of young people will be like, that old shit, get out of here. You know, right. he's all old head. You know, I don't want to hear that. Or they're not even going as far in depth as, you know what I'm saying, as you did, where you know who he was fucking with. And, right. like, as deep as it gets, you know what right. I'm saying? How he was getting people from all over the culture to come and help put put a, put a little help in, you know, and right, and not everyone who else looks, could do not, that. Yeah, who else could do that? But not everyone looks at that, you know. Not everyone's going that far How depth of to, to to find out who he's fucking with. People are seeing it in the videos, yeah. Right. People who, but it's like I mean, when it comes to like directors and stuff like that, they're not going that far. They're like, who directed this? Right. Not everyone does that. Right. But y'all should though. People should, so then you can see how far it goes. You'll see how far he really is. He really has got his fingers and everything. Yeah, and you how and how much pull he has. Because he's got a lot of pull. Fuck it's yeah, like Obama level. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Straight up. It's for real, for real. Straight up. Uh, I, Obama's the only other person that could probably do this. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, to be honest with you, like, uh, but, um, yeah. now, nah, you know, I think that, uh, Jay Z put out a good album. You know, was it better than Damn? Not, in certain aspects it was, in certain aspects yeah. it wasn't. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you could say it's debatable. Kendrick Kendrick definitely deserved everything he got, but I will say this though: <laughs> the person who <laughs> snubbing everybody has <laughs> got to be Bruno Mars. Mm. He he, I think he won the most awards. Yeah, yeah, he he murked it, bro. You know what I'm saying? Was popping out there. People people are listening to Bruno. Is it is it is it that people? I'm not even all that like the biggest fan of Bruno, but no. I can't I, I you can't, can't deny, deny that he has his. But let me ask you this. Is it is it the fa- is it that everybody likes Bruno Mars, or is it that the industry has played his fucking music so damn much that you think you like it? That comes into play because it is overplayed. <laughs> they still playing Twenty Four Karat Magic. Yes, it should it's get way overplayed. That, right. that I, that's why I think I got like you got just annoying fatigue. to me. Like, yeah. I'm just like I don't want. It. I don't want to hear Bruno Mars. <laughs> it got to that point where it was like, and then when someone's playing it in their car, I'm just like. I know, right? Yeah, but headphones you, the, go into my ears. The and funny I'm like, thing is, though, play is something that, in my own ears. The funny <laughs> thing is, you know the song word for word, though. Nah, actually, I don't. Carried magic in the air. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you can't tell me that's I that don't song. Know, is yeah, yeah, it is, but I don't, I don't know the. Whole, but know it's the fucking. It's it, you don't know the lyrics. I don't know all the lyrics. Oh man, you gotta know how to drip and finesse, baby. Oh my god. <laughs> Somebody asked somebody asked Bruno Mars that shit on Twitter. It was like, "Yo, what does it mean to drip and finesse?" He was like, "I'm afraid if you don't know by now, you'll never, never know. know." And he was like, "Good luck to you, Ryan. Good luck to you on your travels." You know what I'm saying? Oh shit! I was like, "Then he's right. You don't know what drip and finesse is now. Then you're never you're gonna never, fucking. You get shouldn't it. know. 
you just shouldn't know if you don't know <laughs> right. right now. Man, I guess shout out to supposed to know. I feel like the Grammys they did they did they tried, but yeah, it's still a little bit they more. Still got, got work to do. Still got work to do. Still got work to do. From what I'm hearing, yeah, yeah like I said, I didn't I didn't watch it, but I did watch the Kendrick performance, so I do know that he killed it, and he probably had the first few rows scared, right? Because he yeah, had, that he, performance he had was fire. He had a squad with him. That so performance that was, was fire. Dope. That shit was dope. It was fire. I like how they did that shit. You know, yeah. definitely dope. Yeah. Shouts out! Shouts out to Kendrick Lamar. Shouts out to to Jay Z. I need to catch me a, a Kung Fu Kenny show. <laughs> That's all I know. <laughs>